one can gaze upon something and see the wonder in it. Two can gaze together and share that wonder. We are forever emitting sparks of imagination. So, let's spark together. In every mind is a piece of code that operates our creative functions. It forms a conduit called the cerebrum umbilical cord that extends to the farthest reaches of imagination. So let's build. Together we can push back the boundaries until they are a mere speck on the stellar horizon. Let's fly. Let's put our minds together and create. Everyone on this orb of dreamers contributes ideas. They ascend the cerebrum umbilical cord to congregate in the Imagisphere, the natural home of our creative wanderings. So join us, for you have always been and always will be most welcome in Little Big Planet. When you visit Little Big Planet, you become your true and pure self, a cuddly, excitable adventurer called a sack person. And this is you. What a cracker! Use the left stick to move your sack person. A little tippy-tappy for a shuffle and a somewhat more substantial push for a bound. Take a run and jump, why don't you? You do it by pressing the action button. A quick tap for hippity hop. Transporting oneself from the earthly plateau to the realm of little big planet is akin to being born again. You emerge here a bundle of naked woolly innocence. The operative word being naked. Put some clothes on that say, I mean business, buster. Get some gadabout trousers or an adventurer's hat, for example. To do so, bring up your poppet with the menu button and select the Customize Character option. From there, you can peruse its contents with the left stick and don your chosen attire with the action button. Once you are suitably suited and booted, having raided your boutique, a press of the back button shows off your new togs to your peers. If you live by the sea, that is. Have you noticed that sack personages, as they gad about the Imagisphere, all wear a poker face because they're concentrating on the task in hand? Well, it doesn't have to be like that all the time, you know. You can change your expressions using the directional buttons. It's easy. Press up to show us your winning smile. Down brings out a frown. Right brings out your cross face, whilst left makes you look scared. 
You can nod and shake your head by waving your controller around and even switch to control of your hips by clicking the left stick. Get a wiggle on, why don't you? As if that wasn't enough, try pressing the limb buttons and using the left stick and right stick. Look, you're waving. Yes, very good. I'm waving back. Really, I am. Honest. It's, it's, it's embarrassing now. Stop it. Now, I know you're eager to get stuck into all this, but please remember the ethos of the Imagisphere. Create and share and, above all, have fun. And you know, there's room for more than one you in the word fun. In fact, the plural of you, when written down, looks like us. Yes, 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 yes. Thanks for that, old man. I'll take it from here. Oh, what luck! There's my little chum-to-be, ready to come and help me sort out Bunkum. Just a simple press of this button and our adventure will begin. Ah, oh, no, so the one on the left, no, but if, if I'm facing it, then that would be on the... Oh, that's the one! Right, old chap. My name's Newton. Welcome to Bunkum Chummy Chum Chum, where the sky is strewn with circling clouds of imagination, all ceaselessly pumped into Bunkum's atmosphere by the pounding creative heart at its core, a magnificent moon of wonder. But I'm afraid Bunkum's destiny lies in our hands. Let me explain. Long ago, before the Negativitron nearly laid waste a craft world, three gluttonous gargoyles gorged on Bunkum's bountiful creativity. Inspiration dried up. We teetered on the brink of the abyss. And then, three heroes came. With their speed, with their power, with their grace, They finally managed to capture the Titans. With Bunkum restored to the creative paradise you see around you, the heroes retired to the pages of myth. A myth that also foretells of the return of the Titans. Tonight, just before bedtime, all of Bunkum's nightmares become real. And that's where I, I mean, we, come in. Join me, my noble assistant. Bunkum's very future depends on we two brave heroes.
Let's get down off this mountain. I've got a prezi for you. Oh, how I love the mountain air. It's just so... airy. Press up and down on the left stick to move in and out of the screen. Pull down on the left stick and press the action button to jump down a step. If you jump in front of a step, you'll automatically shift backwards onto it. Did I ever tell you about the time I got stuck in a hat? I did? Well, it's a true story and still relevant today, as the danger of getting stuck in Little Big Planet is as real as it ever was. If you find yourself in an impassable crevice or an insurmountable rut, your poppet holds the key to your salvation. Open it with your menu button and highlight the retry option using your left stick. Then simply hold the action button until your little stitched chum pops himself senseless. Don't worry, he'll be back in a... Layer launchers spring you from front to back and back to front. That's it! Bounce in and out like a, like a, um, uh, uh, bouncing in and out thing. Excellent work. Your bounding knows no bounds. Use the action button to trigger blue layer launchers. Use the grab button to climb along a climbable surface. You can still jump while you're climbing. Just press the action button. Wonderful work. I knew you could do it. Right. Good work. Let's go. Use the grab button to take hold of spongy bits and the left stick to drag them about. Tap the action button while dragging or pushing to give yourself a little oomph. What are you doing in there? We haven't got all day. Oh, yes, good work. We are amazing. Grab that old dangly thing and use the left stick to swing across. Jolly useful, eh?